Austrian composer, critic, and teacher, Joseph Rupert Rudolf Mahler, was born in May of 1882. After, after a variety of academic pursuits, he earned several degrees, including a doctorate in 1909. Serious composition for him began in 1908. During the following four years, in addition to his duties as an academic and critic, he composed approximately 120 songs. His complete number of theater compositions totals about 150, most with just piano accompaniment. In these brooding songs, in which the body and the soul seek fulfillment for love, his song reflects that of a late romantic growth, and then Richard Strauss. Later compositions, as evident, as evident by the lead, are the encounter of the Italian Buchheim, the leader book. There's a somewhat impressionistic flavor which reflects Debussy in these later compositions. But it's generally agreed that Mach's style was quite considerable. And the final composer, Sergei Rachmaninoff, considered by many critics and musicians as one of the greatest pianists of the 19th and 20th century. My mother was born in 1873 into a family of well, well versed in music. As a pianist, conductor, and composer, he was a product of both St. Petersburg and Moscow Conservatories and became an international personality at a very early age, around 19. He concertized and traveled frequently throughout Europe. Asia and the United States, where he finally settled in Beverly Hills, California, and there he died in 1943. Although the majority of his concert audiences are more familiar with his piano and orchestral literature, he also composed approximately 100 art songs. The biographer and critic Irvin Cullen referred to Rachmaninoff's songs as being some of his most distinguished writing other than his very large poems. Of the five songs chosen for this evening's performance, the first three are representative of the post-romantic era. The last two are the texts from among his favorite romantic poets, Pushkin, and Bob. Again, in the words of Colin, they present a rather simple vocal line, but a very sensitive accompaniment that emphasize certain words and phrases by melodic inflection and shapings. A great composer. Thank you very much.